What's good, YouTube? It's your boy, Hunter Howard Jan. I'm back with another YouTube video, and today we're going to react to Dante Moore, the five-star quarterback, the number three-ranked quarterback in the class of 2023. And I'm ready to check him out, man. Um, I think he's from Michigan. I'm not entirely too sure. We'll see at the end of the video, but it's been a minute since I checked out a quarterback. The last one was Malachi Nelson, and offer up a little easy throw. So it looked like this quarterback, you could call it top-heavy. Off rankings, you would call this quarterback, I mean this um, class quarterback top heavy because I think it's like four quarterbacks that's ranked in the top 10. That was a die. I ain't gonna lie. That was a nice die right there. They playing in the Lions Stadium. So yeah, Detroit, Michigan. Up easy. So it, it's crazy. It's crazy that four quarterbacks are in the top 10. It might be five, but I'm pretty sure it's just four. Um... And two of them, the first two players in the nation are Arch and um, Malachi. So, quarterback class looking pretty good so far, huh? That was a little easy throw, but the thing is, it's a lot of good quarterbacks in this class. I'm pretty sure, even though I only react, this is my third one. Oh, oh, that was a die, and you seen him get hit. I don't know how many people peep, but he got hit on that play, too. Up easy, just throw it up to one of your best receivers. He's just going to come down with it, but... But um, what I was saying is, it's crazy that this class has have a lot of the high-rated quarterbacks. But I still think the class of 22 quarterbacks better for some reason. I don't know. The class of 22 got some goons, bro. So maybe just the class of 22 as a whole is better than this class. I, I, I can't judge that right now because I still got a lot of players to react to. He throwing dots, though, man. He really is. He making it look easy, but... It's hard to say, but I think the class of 22 quarterbacks are better. And they none of them, well, I think Cade is top 10 now. I think Cade top 10 now, so never mind. Let me take that back. But they have four quarterbacks in, they, in their top 10 for this class. Class 22 have only one, and that was after the All-American game. So that's interesting to me because I think class of 22 got way more better quarterbacks because they got like Cade, Cade um, Kubnick, Kubnick, however you say his last name. They got Drew Allard. They got... Connor Wigman, um, Drew Simpson, um, I mean not Drew Simpson, Ty Simpson, um, who else? It's a couple of other, they names ain't really coming to my mind now, but they not, so that, them quarterbacks being that low, and I feel like those quarterbacks class group is better than this quarterback class group, that they kind of tell me like that that um, class 22 had more skill players, like skill players and trenches players better, like they have more good ones than this one i don't know maybe y'all get what i'm saying i don't know if i explained that right but they do got class 22 do got a lot of players who dogs like watching nolan jeremiah alexander marvin jones who else um um mikhail williams luther burden um evan stewart like they got some dudes harold perkins like yeah i'll for real, at this, at this point, I watched a couple of Class 2023 players. I, I, I'm leaning towards Class 2022 being better. I can say, I feel like I can say that definitively. Definitively. Hopefully, I'm saying that damn word right. I'm tripping. Oh, easy. What are you doing? Yeah, he throwing dots, though. I know I've been talking about other stuff about the Oh, look at the ref. He was running with him. I know I've been talking about the other stuff, but this dude, he, he definitely looked nice, man. He throwing some dots, man. That's... That's like the only thing you really care about with a quarterback. Of course, you care about the arm strength, but if he throwing dots, it's, it's nothing else you can really say. Like, bro, throwing some good passes. Like, look at that oh back. Like, look at that back um back shoulder throw right there. Up oh, throwing it, throwing a dot and dude right in his face. Yeah, this dude tough. He tough. He tough, man. He tough. Um, it's it's hard to rank these guys right now, man. I, I probably do it in his own video, but LSU. Oh, LSU in this? I don't think I seen LSU in this the last time I clicked on his profile. So dang, LSU get him out of Michigan. They get the number six player in the nation. That'll be huge for them. Michigan, they gonna have to. They Michigan, Michigan, Michigan State gonna they better tighten up for LSU take him out of there. If this right, if he really looking at um LSU, so that'll be that'll be tough if LSU able to get another hot five star quarterback. <laughs> They'll be looking real good again, but that's gonna be it for the video. Y'all let me know if y'all think he better than Malachi or Arch. I'm not gonna see in this video, but yeah, I'm gonna catch y'all next time.